two losses and a tie see Norwich have a very rough start to the Premier League season. Can we get some results in today's episode and start to turn our fortunes around? Hey everybody, the career mode expert back here for another episode with Norwich. Now we're looking at some of the player conversations, Godfrey's looking to get some more minutes, and I'm happy to give it to him, he's played well whenever I've given him the chance. And Oxborough is thankful for the games he's gotten in as well, again he's been performing too. So I'll give Godfrey the nod for this match coming up, and same with Oxborough, I'm just going to keep him between the posts for now, he's been playing well. So up next is Brighton, this should be a winnable one for us. Alright, away at Brighton for another game. It's Brighton with the ball to start, and let's see if we can get our first big win of the season. Pookie with a nice pass out wide to Hernandez. He looks to cut that back, it's up to the top of the box. We're working it around, and a really poor shot. It's Brighton with the ball now. Crossing it in, and an acrobatic clearance. Crossed in again. Just barely dealt with by Oxborough. That's a great point blank save. We get the ball away now. Looking to find Hernandez on the break. And the second pass does get through. A great piece of skill. He blows by his man. Can we finish? And Pookie just wide of the post. There might be another chance on here. It's flicked up. And Patterson sends it wide. And Brighton with the ball again. Has it go, Oxborough, outstanding. Still Brighton with it, they're creating a lot of opportunity. It's put in and Oxborough is there again. He's been fantastic tonight. It's Aaron's with it now. Looking to work the ball up the field. Patterson, patient possession here. It's a return pass out wide. Great piece of skill from Buendia. It's a header in the back of the net. Fantastic team goal from Norwich. And it's a brilliant piece of skill from the wide man to create that opportunity. It's Brighton down at the other end now. That ball crossed in. And it's a weak header at goal. Norwich with a bit of space here. Pookie's played in behind. Can we capitalize? It's crossed in. A beautiful finish. Again, Norwich looking deadly on the break. Pookie does really well to pick his man out. Buendia does well to win the ball back. It's Patterson charging forward. It's played through. Pookie's on again. He's one-on-one -on -one with the goalie. And it's a superb finish again. It's our striker who's been the star player tonight. Brighton working the ball into the box. Again, comfortable for Oxborough. Dia now out on the wings. Finds Morris with the return. And it's a beautiful finish. A curling effort from quite some distance. Morris making the impact late in the game as a sub. That's such a tight angle. Norwich still with possession. It's four to nothing now. Can we get one more chance? No, the full-time whistle blows and Brighton are out of luck as we smash them 4-0. Alright, so I'm going to sim up to our next game against Stoke City. They're another one of our fellow promoted teams from the championship last season and they're doing pretty well in 6th place. Let's see if we can pull a result out here. Here we go, it's game time against Stoke City. We're back in front of the home fans at Carrow Road. It's a must win sort of match tonight. That ball put in for Stoke. It's clipped but just wide. Still Stoke with possession, whipping that in and it's cleared. Again, it's sent out wide. The ball whipped in, it's close there to cover though and he clears it away. We're back in possession. There could be a break on. The ball worked central. Twisting and turning. It's a long ball out to Aarons. And he plays that up for Buendia, who whips one in, but the center back is there. 
Stoke now with it. It's a nice ball played through behind our defense. Crossed in, and Oxborough does well. That ball played up again for Stoke. It's whipped in and sent wide. It's our turn now on the other end. Played through to Buendia. He cuts it back. Brilliant skill. Crosses it in and Pookie finishes. That is an absolutely fantastic goal. Such a great piece of skill from the winger. And Pookie does really well to finish from that angle as well. He does so well on headers for someone who's not that tall. But he finishes once again. Stoke looking dangerous now. It's cut out and a great save from Oxborough again. That ball sent forward. First time in, Oxborough there comfortably. The ball rolled out and it's full time. Norwich come away with three points. That was a really important match for our season. A tough game for sure, but we get the result we needed. Alright, so I'm going to continue training the same youth players in between games here. Garcia's progressing nicely. Now we've drawn Liverpool in the cup, which is really unfortunate. But I still want to give some of our fringe players minutes just because we don't care about this cup that much. I'm going to put Morris up top and hudson Adoy out on the left. I want to see what they can do for the team. Steeperman's going to get back in the side. Heiss and Pinto can get some minutes at fullback. And I do want to see Garcia make his debut for the team. I'm excited to see how he can perform. Cruel's back in the lineup as well. All right, here we go. It's a debut for Eric Garcia, our new center back. I'm excited to see how he can perform out here against a really tough opposition. There he is, lining up for the handshakes. How will he fit into this side? And the kickoff gets underway. It's game time. Working the ball around. It's played through up to Morris. He opts for the cross and it's cut out by the defense. But Tete has a go, unbelievable save. He did so well to settle that and have a go. Great reflex save. Corner comes in and Morris sends it wide. Nice opportunity. Liverpool with a lot of the ball to start. Wijnaldum plays it up. It's Mane, great save from Cruel. Again, Liverpool charging up. It's a shot from distance just wide. Again, looking to find an opening. It's crossed in, just dealt with. Garcia doing well. I'm gonna make a quick substitution here at halftime. I want Leitner out for Patterson who can give us a more attacking threat, I think. Here we go, Liverpool with the ball to start the second. Really gotta clear this ball out. It's crossed in. Wijnaldum, Cruel makes another great save. How great have both of our goalkeepers been recently? Liverpool with the corner. It's a clever flick, just blocked. And cleared away. They do win it back though. It's Fabinho now, a shot deflected again. We really have to clear, there's so much pressure on our goal. Once again, Liverpool winning it back. It's a shot from distance, Cruel once again. Lovin plays that ball out wide, it's intercepted though. Liverpool really putting the pressure on, it's Salah. He plays that one up. It's a shot, Cruel gets down to make the save yet again. He has been outstanding tonight. And it's played up, we might be on the break here. It's hudson Adoy on the wings. Can he pick out a man? He tries to go at it alone and messes that one. Hudson Adoy cutting in, it's flicked up and a shot from distance. Liverpool yet again. Salah with a nice pass, it's a volley off the bar from Mane. What an amazing goal that would have been, but we're kept safe. Again, Hudson Adoy in the wing. A nice bit of skill. He plays that up to Patterson. He beats his man. In a bit of room, he crosses it in, and it's a finish by Steeperman. What a goal that was. It could be so important for Norwich. Nice movement from Patterson to find a bit of room, and Steeperman just peels off of his man and finishes calmly. Liverpool looking to get back into this match. 
It's played down the wing and crossed in. Cruel makes the save though. And now Hudson Adoy holding it up on the wing. He beats his man. Still Hudson Adoy, but it's taken off of him. That ball cleared out. Time running out now. Can we hang on to the lead? Morris plays it up. And it's full time. An enormous win as we take down Giants Liverpool. Garcia does well to hold the team to a clean sheet in his debut match. And everyone on the squad played out of their minds tonight. Liverpool definitely had their chances, but we defended well for the most part and kept the team spirit high. That was a really big win for morale. The fans are going wild. Alright, so I'm going to end this episode on a high note with that win. We sit in 7th place, doing better than I thought we would at this stage, and I'm excited to see where things can go in the next episode. Thanks so much for watching everybody, I'm the Career Mode Expert, and I'll catch you all next time.